When designing our Microsoft project plans, there are occasions when, for completeness, we need to enter tasks that have already happened. The Microsoft project by default isn't keen on this and can often complain with our messages telling us that this is before the project start date. In this video, I'll show you without resorting to time travel how you can tell Microsoft project to start on a date in the past. So let's look at this example project plan designed in Microsoft project. We have a project kickoff meeting. There are two work streams coming out of that meeting to develop their plans. And I designed this plan on Saturday the 23rd of November. So as far as project is concerned, that's the project start date. So if I add a milestone that was before that date, i.e. the 23rd of November, such as project budget agreed, and quite rightly, Microsoft Project tells us that we've tried to insert a date before the project start date, i.e. the 23rd of November. Now granted, we get the chance to continue and move the task to before the project start date, but that could be tedious if you have to do that multiple times. So how do we avoid this situation? Well, let me tell you about the start date feature built into Microsoft Project. So in our project plan, if we select the project tab and then project information, we're presented with various information about the project, including start date. And sure enough, the start date is the date when I created this project plan, Saturday the 23rd of November. By dropping this start date down, we get the usual Microsoft calendar and we get a chance to choose the date when the project started. Now, I added a task that was on the 18th of November, which was budget agreed. But let's imagine that the project actually started at the first Monday of November, which was the 4th. Selecting that as usual and clicking OK, nothing much terribly happens. So let's try inserting budget agreed again. And it was a milestone. And it was previously on the 18th. Now sure enough, there's no complaints from Microsoft Project about starting early. We do get an error message, however, or a warning message, if you like, telling us that we've set a date which doesn't allow Microsoft Project to control the date as much as it would like to, but that's okay, we'll keep that constraint. Let's try something different. Let's try making it a wee bit earlier again. Again, no complaints from Microsoft Project. Now remember, we set the start date of the project to be the first Monday of the month in November. So let's try putting a task in before that date. So let's pick Friday the 1st. And sure enough, we're back to getting our complaints from Microsoft again that we've inserted a task before the project start date, which, however, this time is telling us is the 4th of November as we manually set. Let's rectify that. Well, I hope you found that useful. I must admit it's one of the first things I do when I start a new project plan is set my project start date. If you would like some more hints and tips on how to use Microsoft Project, then my social media channels are listed on screen just now, as are my contact details. Until the next time, bye-bye.